has its work cut out for itself. Can the dream shock the world or will Seattle dominate? Say it with me, kick! Looking forward to seeing Seattle, one of the top teams in the LFL, playing Denver with five new players. Let's see if they can compete. Michael said he's gonna mix it up tonight, we'll see. They are mixing it up. That is a backward lateral to Angel. Now finding Matheny. Development, Shalin Canfield is in at quarterback. Handing off to Amber Smith, one of the recent pickups. Seattle defense to muddle up so Canfield cannot read coverages. That is a fourth and 17 interception. Michelle Angel. The player, watch this. She intercepts the ball and then turns it into six. Michelle Angel, the backup quarterback, starting safety. What is First and 10, ball at the Denver 15. Towner in the shotgun, fakes the handoff to Smith, rolling right, taking about a year to get to the outside. Her back, a spread option. She fakes inside, takes it outside. Now Mary Towner doesn't have those kind of wheels to get outside, obviously. Field position a bit. That might be a smart move, actually. A third and 16, heavy rush off the edge. So far, but they're gonna work on the connection tonight. A second and goal ball at the Denver eight. From the shotgun, Matheny just lobbing it over the middle. Made that so much easier with footwork. Second and 10, ball remains at the 15. It looked like Denver may have jumped. That was miscommunication with Ambline. Towner remains in at quarterback, dropping back. And throwing down the field a good arm. Seattle's offense again with a short field. This time taking over at the 11, handoff to the bowl. A first and 10, ball at the Denver 15. Handoff, a really delayed, ugly looking handoff to Amber Smith. Getting up a third and 15. Towner looking over the middle and Hawkins. This may be a safety. Takes over at the 16 yard line. That is Randall in motion. Faking the handoff to Schnorr, throwing down the seam, just lobbing it up. A second and 10, ball remains at the 16, a wishbone set. Dominique Malloy, and look at that field. We'll see if they can work underneath. A second and 10 play, throwing underneath and complete. That is complete quarterback. We see her playing receiver. It might be a good move by Carlos Bates because I Playing quarterback, hence the change to Towner. Towner looking back to throw, and that is intercepted again by Michelle Angel. 2016, that's what led to her being signed by Seattle. Now throwing down the field and connecting. Comfort you can take in that, playing the Denver Dream. Well, he's scared, and he told me he doesn't want to play Los Angeles and get punched in the face, and then his team's shocked. You know, what's going on? Lindsey Fields, Stacey Harmon, they're doing a good job up front. Towner throwing over the middle, intercepted again. This time by Jessica Hopkins, another. We would run with anybody, but Carlos Bates is an old defensive player at Georgia. You would think he'd teach these girls at least how to tackle. So again, she has great ball skill. I mean, she can catch it. She has awareness. She sees it. She makes a play on a, on a deflected ball. Just a great defensive player. It's certainly not in the LFL. A second and 10 ball at the 14. Going down the field, Angel. Yard line, a split back set. And off Schnorr breaking through the first arm tackle into the third layer of the defense. And a first and 10 ball at the 15. Towner trying to run up the middle. To side, she's just as good. A second and nine going down the field to Walker. Under throwing Towner. She wants to put some points on the board. A third and nine crossing pattern. A fourth and nine for this offense. Towner back to pass, a lot of pressure in the pocket, now stepping up. Not taking the foot off the pedal here. Angel in the shotgun, gonna take off with it herself, has a seam to the outside. Field, Angel saw the hole, put it in the fifth gear, looked like she's going in the end zone to Grot, bam! Where's that been all? But they just don't have the personnel, I think, to compete in the LFL. That is a handoff to Amber Smith. Works with the talent you have. A second and six handoff again to Amber Smith. That sometimes can be in play football in the second half. Buckle up and get ready. The second half, the first half was an absolute disgrace if you're a Denver Dream fan. 14 for the Denver offense. A poor snap back to Towner. Now Towner throwing down the field, intercepted. An ill-advised pass, that is Kiera. Touchdown. 
This is poor technique. They have her right there in the backfield for a loss. They just don't know how to tackle. That is Towner. Like you and I. This is the most stress-free game I've ever seen Chris Michelson like this. A poor hand. Watch the lack of urgency. The ball is on the ground. Nobody goes after it from Denver. Not even the running back gives a strong effort. And they walk in. Where's the rest of the team? Denver coaches, as they are seeing this game completely unravel. This is Michelle Angel just standing in the pocket. Or Let's take another look at this. I like how Angel improvises. Her main target's not open. By some time, throws it up. Should have been broke. Four to nothing. Chris Michelson calling plays for all the players, letting everybody get in the action, but Shade. People think that she's more accurate, actually, than KK Matheny. That's Jade Randall leaping in to run like she did that one eight-yard gain early in the game. Another ugly-looking handoff to Smith, trying to get to the outside. Ball pops out. They're two of the most intense players and coaches in the league, and they are having so much fun tonight, just relaxed, enjoying the game. Immediate passing. We'll see if they go back to that. No, this is a handoff. Jasmine Davis. I'm telling you what, Jade Randall has to get a spark at running back, but it doesn't matter who you put in if there's no blocking. A third and 18. Towner back to pass over the middle. Has a goal at the Seattle Six. That is Towner back to pass crossing pattern. I'm not sure. The offensive line, they're setting up the pass block. Towner on her own goes outside with nobody blocking for the run. Just a bad decision by Towner. She has the skills. A third and goal, Towner across the middle. And that is intercepted again. That is a pair for Schnorr throwing the football now. A third and six handoff to Christine Cortez. A very prominent in this game on both sides of the field. Schnorr remains in at quarterback. Good looking pass in the flat to Danielle Hawkins. Season thought that Angel could potentially contest Matheny for that starting spot as Christine Cortez just barrels her way in. Ball at the one yard line, so this will be a one point attempt to Kiara Williams. Alyssa Stongel and Sep them out, but they have to try to use the game as a scrimmage somehow. A first and 10, Towner throwing to the outside. Tonight, on defense, they look rock solid. Another poor snap. This time, Towner finding fields. We mic up our U.S. players. They don't, they're not as polite to the referees. That was a very Canadian approach. Towner from the shotgun. Smith in the backfield. Another drop by Walker. It's both sides of the ball, solid effort. Seattle will, it'll be interesting to see if she gets the start next week. This is a handoff to Cortez on a first and 10. One, his players getting overconfident. They gotta play Austin. They might punch him right in the nose. So they prove in starters, they can start either one of them and win football games. That'll do it for us here in Denver.